factorize x square minus 17 x plus 60 and x square minus 23 x plus 60 while factorizing these two where do we get the difference i will let you know but before that let us do certain steps in that step one coefficient of x square that is one here should be multiplied to the constant plus 60 so 1 into plus 60 is plus 60 this is your step 1 next now you should look out for two numbers such that when you add these two numbers you should get middle coefficient minus 17 and also when multiplied you should get plus 60 i repeat now you should look out for two numbers such that when you add them you should get middle coefficient minus 17 and also when multiplied you should get plus 60 now do the same thing here the coefficient of x square 1 multiplied to the constant plus 60. We get plus 60. Now look out for two numbers such that when you add them, you get middle coefficient minus 23. And also when multiplied, you should get plus 60. Now to get those two numbers, for that we should take LCM of 60. So the LCM we take here. The last digit 0, so take 5. The first number 6, a number close to 6 in 5 table is 5 once 5. 6 minus 5, 1, 1 carried forward 10. When do we get 10 in 5 table? 5, 2 is 10. Now here we have 12, 12 is 2, 6, 12. Now 6 is 2, 3 is 6. Now 3, 3 is a prime number, so 3, 1 is 3. Now here is where the difference between the two comes. And the difference is this. Difference is while selecting the numbers here. What I mean is C. The two numbers which we should write here are these. First number is 5 and the second number is 2 into 2, 4 into 3, 12. 12 plus 5, 17, 12 into 5, 60. So write 12 here and 5 here. Now the two numbers which we should be writing here are these. Five into two, ten into two, twenty, and the second number is three. Twenty plus three, twenty three. Twenty into three, sixty. So here you write twenty and three here. Now we should adjust the signs. What I mean is C. Over here we have minus seventeen. To get minus 17, we should place negative here and also here. Minus 12 minus 5 is minus 17 minus 12 into minus 5 is plus 60. Now here, we should get minus 23. To get minus 23, we should place negative here and also here. Minus 20 minus 3 is minus 23. Minus 20 into minus 3 is plus 60. So we have adjusted the signs in both. Did you understand? The difference between these two is only while selecting the numbers. And the rest of it is same. Now you change this to x square. In place of minus 17x, now we should write this. Minus 12x minus 5x plus 60. Did you understand? 
in place of minus 17x we have written this next now from these two terms what can be taken out common x so here you get x minus from this x out you get 12 now whatever we got here here also we should get the same thing now from this x has gone inside so outside you get minus 5 even if you multiply and check still you get the same thing now you take out x minus 12 common so here you have x and here minus 5 this is the answer to this one now here you change this to x square in place of minus 23x now you write this minus 20x minus 3x plus 60 now from these two terms what can be taken out common x so here you get x minus from this x out you get 20 now whatever we got here here also we should get the same thing now from this x has gone inside so outside you get minus 3 now you take out x minus 20 common so here you have x and here minus 3 this is the answer to this one did you understand the difference between the two Am I clear?